And that's what made it like kind of like a hot topic where it's like, I want to get on. How do I get on? How do I get on? How do I get into this club? Did you get on? Can you put me on? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no, you put didn't Put me on the on? guest list. Yeah, right. Hey, everyone. Welcome to another Raise My Hand, Can I Start Speaking episode. We're the hosts. My name is MJ. My name is Adam. Who yeah. Thank you for joining us. It's a Friday. Friday's a good day. Why? Because people say, I hate my job. Can't wait. Tomorrow's the weekend. The weekend. Love it. <laughs> but then you just sit around and don't do anything. Over the video games. Play video games. But hey, thanks for joining us today, everyone. We're going to be talking about the hot app that everyone's jumping on, mm. if you're invited. Oh. Clubhouse. Welcome to my clubhouse. Clubhouse. Wow, 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 wow. You're invited. Wow, wow, everybody. Everyone's jumping on. New type of SNS. New form where it's all just audio, one picture, but you're not posting anything. Mm. It's all about having like a radio station yeah. where there's an audience that is listening to this live radio station. And they have the choice to be a part of the topic and discussion, mm. or they can just sit back and, and listen, listen to it and enjoy it. And it's this new kind of SNS that has everyone being you're very intrigued to see what the future holds mm. and everyone wants to get on but there's a catch what's the catch you can't just sign up you must be invited by someone who has already a spot in the app i see you gotta be invited so then that had me thinking like wow so the creators of this mm. have seen sns different variations of it and it's like anyone can just go and create a a profile page. Right. You can go and create fake profiles and do a lot of harm on the internet. Oh, yeah, for sure. And it seems like this new way of entering the system is, is something to combat that. To try to be like, if you're a person mm -hmm. who's a good person, you probably have friends who are good people. If you are invited on the app, mm -hmm. the person who invited you is probably a good person. Probably. And the people that you know are probably good people mm. so you are allowed to ask them invite them to join the app so it's like See. a really tight community yeah. of possibly like-minded people so then when you're on it hopefully you'll be talking to people who are similar to your friend base ah, now right now okay. it's grown to the point where there's a bunch of people right but just that whole idea i think was really interesting mm -hmm. how it's it's you know not everyone can get on and that's what made it like kind of like a hot topic where it's like i want to get on how do i get on how do i get on how do i get into this club? did you get on can you put me on yeah so that's it it's very very interesting yeah. adam what did you think about this when you first heard about this uh, new app clubhouse? i also was curious about it uh and and a while ago one of our favorite media people yeah. Gary Vaynerchuk was talking about how in the future audio is going to be very important. It's going to be, you know, a trending thing that everyone should start now to work on their audio if they want to be influencers or if you have a business, you should have an audio podcast talking about your business. Yes. And when this app came out, I thought, wow, like the future is here now because with this, it's audio only. It gives anyone the chance to open up conversation about any topic they can just put it on the table if they're having conversations with their friends such an easy way such an easy way i mean you have your phone bam turn it turn on, it on done and and the the good interesting thing about it it's called clubhouse because imagine you're just with your friends talking in a room we would call it a clubhouse but it's usually like intimate conversations yeah. sometimes just having that opportunity to hear top celebrities conversations between each other mm. or top business people's conversations between each other or just join in and listen to a lecture or something like that yeah yeah for people who are interested or on any topic also having the opportunity to give your in input yes and feedback on the topic as well and yes. have that communication flowing so right. the whole idea is is really like you said interesting intriguing right 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 because right there's podcasts mm -hmm. and that has been right. a, a normal thing yeah. for audio style of content mm -hmm. But here, it turned it into SNS where there is interaction now right, involved. Right, yeah. So you can be a part of this this podcast, right. which is really cool. And of course, uh, it, it, I say it's similar to live radio mm -hmm. where once it's played, 
and it's finished, it's gone. Like like you're listening to the radio station, pretty you hear much, some yeah. talk, like that's gone once yeah. it's over. So that's another thing where people are really like on it all the time, really listening because they don't want to miss anything. Right. And that's the point that really makes that drives this to to become a popular app like it is right now. Uh, me and Adam are on this app. We are. We got on. We jumped on. <laughs> we are in the clubhouse. So we've been thinking of ways to you know open up and possibly do some talks, but I, I was I was new to it. Yeah. I would need to learn a lot, and I think that's one thing you need to do in this new world. Pretty much. Almost. It's, it's n- changing all the time. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. so I jumped on. Right. Mm-hmm. Have you been on it? I have looked on it. I've perused. I haven't jumped into any conversations. Oh yet. man. Okay. So <laughs> I I dove in, yeah. and what really helped me was I saw one room mm-hmm. that was titled like Beginners Q and A. Ah. Okay. okay. Sweet. So I go in there, and yeah. there's a bunch of people who are hosting the room, mm-hmm. and they are very well versed yeah. in Clubhouse and how it works. Okay. All these people, they're calling up one by one and doing Q and A. These people have a question like, oh, hey, how do I do this? Or can I link my profile of this, this? And can I, am I allowed to sell stuff? Am I allowed to put like other like background music? Mm. And they're answering all these questions. So I was able to learn a lot. So what I learned was that everyone is very nice. The moderators, they aren't there making money at all. They're there just to help other people learn how to navigate. Because, like, think about it. If we're all driving cars and there's a bunch of people who know how to drive cars and a bunch of people who don't know how to drive, (laughs) there's going to be a lot of accidents. Oh, yeah. (laughs) So the people who know how to drive are like, let's teach these young people, these youngsters (laughs) how to drive. drive." So we can all drive harmoniously. (laughs) That was one thing I I really enjoyed because that's another thing where it's like, wow, this type of SNS so far, there's... You don't see this negativity. Activity, yeah. And mm-hmm. of course, there's been plenty of that that's surfacing. been surfacing. Yes, mm-hmm. yes. But overall, I think it has a lot of potential. There was small, like, little things that I learned in that room where they were saying, like, there's three sections of each room. Okay. You know, of, of, a, of, of a live podcast, I guess you could say. Each radio show. Uh, there's people who are in this on the stage. Okay. And that is the very top. All the pictures are big. And those people on stage are allowed to talk. But if you are invited on stage, like everyone's like, turn off your mic. Only the people who are talking turn on their mic. And it's almost like a walkie talkie where people are like, you say who you are. Yeah. And you have to say, I'm done. And then mute yourself. Oh, and then, wow. So, it, so it's, like, it's, like, it's like a speaking stick. Ah, you know? the conch. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, that's a very nice, you know, don't step on toes. Right. As well as for a listener, it's really hard if... Five people are trying to say something at, at once. At once, right, yeah. So that was one thing, that, a rule kind of within it. Another interesting one was, and then there's the other tiers, or I guess sections of the room. There's people who are following the head moderators okay. or the, the people who are hosting the room. If you are following the host, maybe you could have similar ideas or, or likes hobbies as the people who are following them as well ah, so you can check out their their profiles, profiles and maybe mm. follow them too yeah and then there's the audience who is just listening and can't say anything unless they raise their hand and that's something you could do you raise your hand there's a little hand down there and you say like teacher i'd like to speak can i speak now can i hold the talking stick <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah and the host can then select you bring you up and then you're allowed to talk um of course they have the power to mute you turn mm-hmm. you off and right. send you back to the audience and I thought that was like, wow, I'm like, that's really cool. It's a lot, of, a lot of different, different things, but it still seems like everyone can, can get into this conversation if they choose to. Right. And you don't have to feel scared of joining a conversation and not say anything. You, you can, can totally just, just listen. listen. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Another interesting thing, since there's no chatting, no DMs, you can only connect your Instagram and Twitter mm-hmm. handle. Yeah. So then if you like someone or what they're doing, you want to contact them, you have to go through those other SNS platforms. I see. But one thing, like, people can applaud you and what you're saying. Applaud you? Yeah, you can. What, Interesting, like, right? Like hitting another button instead of raising hands? Oh, hey, hey, oh, hey. Yeah. yeah, dude. Really? So what it is, there's your mute button, right? Yeah. So if you're... On stage, mm-hmm. but you're not speaking. You have to mute yourself so you right. know, no noise comes through. But if you agree with what someone is saying, 
you can't do the you know Aizuchi be like uh 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 because that'd be so, 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 a so, little so, annoying so. for everyone who's trying to listen. Right. So what you do is you you tap your mute button on and off, <laughs> and so your microphone is flashing on your profile picture, yeah. and that means. You applaud. You agree with what is being said. <laughs> I see. Interesting workaround. That is a workaround. Yeah. But does it make sound when you unmute? Nope. Nothing? Nope. You, like, people do it, like, fast enough, so it's just, like, so a just flashing oh, okay. light. I think there's a lot of potential in this app. Not just for, like, podcasting in general, but even learning languages, maybe. Because you can connect with people all around the world without even having to say anything. You can yes. listen to conversations from different yes. countries. Who knows, maybe someday a teacher will make a, a channel for you to go in and they can help you out with your language questions or whatever it is you have. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I was just scrolling right now, you yeah. know, and I see one that's like how to, you know, practice your Japanese. Oh, there you go. There's a group of that. There was one group that I entered and mm -hmm. I spoke a little bit when it was just international connections. People around the world yeah. can come and just introduce yourself. And if you find that one speaker has similar hobbies... Then uh, with you, or yeah. like maybe even like business opportunities, then you can connect with each other and possibly something can bloom from wow. that. Wow. Hey, okay, that sounds cool. Yeah. Uh, and within the, that international connections one, there's a lot of Japanese people coming on and speaking all in English. Wow. And I mean, there was even a few Korean people. There was this one girl I remember who was saying like she was very nervous. It was her first time. She's learning English. Mm -hmm. And she thought to jump on and try it out. And she was very brave. And spoke out and like did very well. So it's like this is a great opportunity for people to do that. Yeah. So please do that. Yeah. If you can get on Clubhouse, that is. That's true. You got to have someone that you know. Ask who a friend is nice, of a friend. Who can invite you. Me and Adam will probably be going live sometimes here and there. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure exactly what we're going to be doing, but we'll be, we'll be, you know. Testing the waters a little bit. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Keeping our swimming caps on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Well, that's it for this episode, everyone. Let us know what you think about Clubhouse, mm. this new app. Are you on it? Have you been in any of the rooms? Have you spoken? What do you think the potential is? What Ooh. can come out of this new app? And if we jump on, what would you like to see from us here on Clubhouse? Let us know in the comments down below. <laughs> <I> see. <laughs> <laughs> Hit that like button. One of the things about Clubhouse is that once... These rooms, these talks are finished. Mm. The audio is gone, completely gone. But hey, if you want a podcast from me and Adam, you can do that by helping us reach our goal of 1,000 members in our YouTube membership right down there next to the subscribe button. Mm -hmm. You can join different tiers. You get different things. Uh, and if we get to 1,000 members, we will start a podcast where everyone can enjoy and listen back to our old talks continuously and you know really great practice for your listening uh or if you just want to laugh here and there sometimes yeah maybe and if you want to connect with us on sns we got an instagram tiktok facebook and twitter as well so try to check us out on one of those channels i think you should try instagram first because that's where we spend most of our time yeah yeah definitely well that's it we'll see you on the next, next step, step. <laughs>